So, I want to show you guys what I believe in, not just for your body yoga, but you can also do facial yoga. And as a 34 year old woman, I think it's important to exercise the muscles in the upper part of your body on your face as well as the muscles on the bottom part of your body. So these are a few exercises that I do. So the first exercise you do is you start with your eyebrows, right? And you raise them like you're surprised. And this is my no makeup video so you guys can see. But you try not to create the lines on your forehead like that. You just simply try to raise your eyebrows. Like open your eyes really big like ah. Okay, and then the next one is underneath your eyes. So you create tension up top like you're holding resistance. And then imagine closing the lids underneath your eyes, your bottom eyelids coming up. So you try not to move anything else but the bottom eyelids. And if that wrinkle bothers you, you can even go further up and go like that. You wanna squish the muscles underneath your eyes. Imagine raising your lids underneath and touching the top eyelids. Okay, and then the next one. Oh, I thought I had somebody help me with lighting. <laughs> um, the next one is, let's see. So the next one is, is the smile lines. So what you want to do is, is pretend like you're putting, like you're blowing up a balloon, but your cheeks are the balloon on each side. So imagine pushing the air up to your cheeks. And this is good for your cheeks and your smile lines. If you can hold your breath that long. Okay, so then the next one is, and you wanna do this after you put, um, after you wash your face and you put your creams on for the night, you wanna go up from your smile underneath your bottom lip, go up, follow the lines, go up, up all the way to your forehead. And you wanna do that like nine times. For me, I use vitamin E. And I put that on my face at night, that really helps. But you follow up and then you can actually go the hairline. I just got a neck pop from that. So go up from the bottom. And then the next one is, this is for underneath your neck to stop the turkey neck that we all don't want, right? Um, so your tongue goes to the roof of your mouth and then you're going to swallow and you're actually going to feel the muscles and you could see them moving. And hold your cheeks up when you're doing it. Um, from the way I learned it, the cheeks weren't held up, but I think it's better because you're sitting here trying to take care of your smile lines and then you're over here creating more while you're doing this exercise. So if you hold your cheeks up, the smile lines won't come, right? So tongue at the roof of the mouth and then swallow. And you could see it working here. It looks silly, I know, but it really, really helps. And you just swallow with your tongue at the roof of the mouth. And then, the last one that I like to do 
is with the ears. So go up and pull your ears back. Because if you think about it, when they do um, surgery where they're doing the lifting stuff, they actually cut this part out and they lift and they pull back. So you can see when you pull back from your ears that your face actually gets tighter and then goes up. So you want to rub back and pull your ears back. And this is all just exercises, just like we do to tighten our butts and our breasts and our you know our arms and everything it's the same thing so come back from your crease of your mouth and go up to your ears oh, I pop in my neck and everything it's really super cool um, last one that I like to do is the eyebrow one because you have to have good eyebrows right so do the eyebrow raise like I showed at the beginning of the video. Okay, so from the center of your nose right here, you want to rub up and rub with the arch of your eyebrows and then do the eyebrow raise with it. Go all the way back into your temple and this is like your own little lift for your face. So do it again and do the surprised eyes with it and then pull back with the temple. So that was the crow's area. So pull back with the temple and then go back from the nose. Whatever fingers feel comfortable for you to pull back into the temple. This is for the cheeks. So this is another one. You actually imagine lifting up underneath your cheeks and always go back into the temple. It's like a lift. So yeah, that's what I do. And this is me with no makeup and I hope you try it at home. Bye.